Hey, how are we? Um, I recently watched a video on uh, kind of Facebook's invasive advertising where it um, records what you're saying and then tries to advertise that thing to you later. Um, so recently that happened to me with the, the quad lock, um, which is like a, uh, it's a product. It's a phone stand for your bicycle or motorcycle. Um, and I was like, oh, I've seen that before. And I kind of wanted to do a video on uh, a different form of invasive advertising, specifically um, in Australia and specifically in Sydney and Melbourne. Um, so yeah, I live in uh, St Ives, which is a suburb, um, and my local shopping centre um, has recently installed these giant, these two big units. Um, they have two, they're not giant, they're like, I guess, 50 to 70 inch TVs. Um, they've got two screens on either side and then I'll show you a video of them and then they have uh, a dome recording device which just looks like a security camera um, but it's it's a lot more than that so what it does is you walk into the store and it plays an ad and it just looks like a screen um, but what it actually is that camera um, records your face and your kind of details and all this is on their website I'll show you the links and stuff but it records records your details, figures out what age you are and like 18 demographics just from like the facial recognition database. And then it advertises an ad specifically at you. Um, and it records the mood that you're in and which moods you're more likely to be receptive to certain ads, that kind of thing. How long you look at the camera for uh, or the, the screen. Um, yeah, which ads you look at. Uh, yeah, I guess how old you are and all that kind of stuff. And I was like, hmm. That's a bit weird. So I'll show you a video of kind of what they are. Um, this is just me today going into the shops recording the, the VMO TV units. VMO stands for Val Morgan Outdoors, which is the brand. And the product that they're selling, like the, the advertising product, they're, they're an advertising company, obviously, um, is called Dart 2.0. Dart 2.0, this is directly from their website, and it says Dart 2.0 anonymously tracks over 2 million Australians and measures those viewing content based on their age, gender, when they viewed and how many viewed, providing more insights and analytics of real-time audience viewing habits. Um, it identifies 18 demographic profiles. It even highlights facial features and can determine moods. Um, and there's a video on it, which I definitely recommend watching. Um, but yeah, it's a bit scary um, because, well, that in Australia, you are legally allowed to film someone without their consent if, as long as they're in a public place, which is a bit weird, and I don't know how I feel about that. Well, I don't feel very good about that, but whatever. Um, I take advantage of it, obviously. Um, but, yeah, so they've recorded a lot of Australians, just, and they have their facial um, features kind of on their database, which they can do because they're a private company. They own that information they can sell it to whoever they want and um, make money off your viewing habits and your kind of uh, face which yeah I don't know how I feel about that but um that's th this is a video of I'll show you this video of exactly what the product is and how it looks when you walk into the shopping center um, I guess just be on the lookout for it you, I didn't know it existed before I saw it um, so, yeah, if you choose to look at it, it's up to you. If you choose not to, that's also up to you. Um, I guess it's just it just pays to be a bit aware of what's going on around you. So, yeah, thanks for listening. See you later.